Hey, what's up, guys? My name is Twitch or Tscored, and today I'm bringing you guys a Type 95 slash M16 Overkill Moab, and I'm gonna call this the Three Round Burst Overkill Moab because both of these two weapons are the only th uh, two Three Round Burst weapons in the game. And I got this idea when I was going for some weird Overkill Moabs the other day, and I realized that I've never seen a video on YouTube of someone using both of the two Three Round Burst weapons at the same time with Overkill. And uh, I think this is a world's first, so I decided to go for it. And uh, it actually only took me like two tries, and uh, I was lucky that I got into this lobby with really bad players, because I had, I actually ended up getting three Moabs in about like five games against these guys. They were just really bad. But uh, like I said, guys, it's an overkill Moab with both of the three round burst weapons, and I try to use them both equally as much, because I don't want to use overkill and then get like 20 kills with one of them and like four kills with the other one. I want to try to make it uh, just as equal. And I'm not really sure how many kills I get with each one, but I'm pretty sure it's split about 12 to 12. And uh, so hopefully you guys enjoy this gameplay. And uh, it's just something unique and different once again. I like to try to go for like weird, unique gameplays and stuff. So I decided to throw an overkill with both of these two three round burst weapons and I managed to pull it off. And right there I wanted to uh, point out a little move that I did. I was getting shot because there was like three enemies right there and I, I, uh, I moved my head down. I used the analog stick and I looked down as I was running away. And uh, all that does is just kind of make your head a little bit smaller, and uh, it makes you a little bit less of a target. And I never see any uh, any players really do that, and it's just kind of helpful if you're trying to run away from a gunfight, and if you just move your head down, you can survive a lot more often. But anyways, guys, so this is Ground War Domination here. Or no, not Domination, sorry guys. Uh, Ground War Kill Confirmed on uh, Arcaden. Usually I always play Domination, but I managed to get this gameplay in Kill Confirmed. And uh, my class setup in this game is the M16 and Type 95, like I said. They both have silencer and rapid fire. Um, I actually would recommend running the red dot sight on both of these guns, but I just wanted to try to make it even that much more unique and weird. So I threw on uh, just the iron sights and I threw on rapid fire and silencer. And uh, the rapid fire on these guns, it really doesn't help that much because they're three round bursts of soul rifles, you know. And uh, they already have a limit, they can only shoot three bullets like each time you press the trigger. But um, it just makes it so the three bullets come out a bit quicker. So, um, it's kind of helpful a little bit, I guess, if you can, uh, just shoot off, uh, multiple rounds, uh, quickly and everything. And then my perks are Scavenger, Overkill, and Marksman. And uh, my specialist perks are Stalker, Sleight of Hand, and Hardline. And I set Hardline for my third one because then it only takes one more kill to get specialist bonus. Usually I would run a quick draw there instead of Hardline because usually I would start out with Hardline. But, um, I just wanted to set Hardline instead of quick draw just because it only takes me one more kill to get me up to that specialist bonus. And uh, yeah guys, this gameplay is pretty good. Um, it's about 4 minutes or so, which I thought was pretty good for a weird overkill moab like this. And uh, these players are really, really bad, like I said. Um, I kind of just played defensive in this gameplay and just kind of uh, played back. Like right here, I'm trying to shoot to the spawn over there. And then uh, I kind of played uh, a bit defensively. I got a lot of my kills from over here on the hill. And then at the beginning of the streak, you guys saw me get like a triple spray and then like a double spray. And uh, I don't really know... Like I said, I don't really know how many kills I get with each gun. Um, if you guys want to count that up, you could. I think it's split about half and half, though. And uh, and I thought this was just a good gameplay. Nice, uh, entertaining Moab. And uh, actually wanted to point something out that uh, I chose an MP7 class when I started this life because I thought that I wasn't going to get this gameplay. So I switched classes to the MP7. So after I die, you guys will see um, I have the MP7 class on. And then I wanted to go for the double Moab. So I switched my classes back to this one, if that makes sense. So um, you guys will see me calling the Moab using an MP7 instead of uh, these weapons, and that's why. Because uh, my class changed, because I changed it at the beginning of this life. So I get the, I called in the Moab here, and uh, I love calling in the Moab and kill confirm because it just drops so many tags. So I picked up all these tags afterwards by Team 1. Um, and that's pretty much it guys, hopefully you enjoyed the gameplay and I'm out, peace.